Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just taking the time out to really see things as in a bigger picture, knowing that everything we're going through um, is is a lessening of blessing towards the stage of our journey heading towards that beautiful life that we really deserve and want <laughs> so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. If you are comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, how it impacted your life and head you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is giving you good vibes or good information you would love to share with a loved one or friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. Thank you once again for the love and support that you've been giving me. It's so greatly appreciated, and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today, this beautiful meditation I'm listening to is called Connect to Source. Connect to the Source. Stimulate and synchronize your energy, power, with the source binary beats and i will post that link in the description box below and today my video is about twin flame 101 dealing with the insecurities in your twin flame relationship oh jesus <laughs> i might be hitting the nail on the head with some of the you know some of the ones you know we all go through our ups and downs through our twin flame relationship knowing nothing is perfect but you know when we're reflecting on that twin flame relationship it will have you looking at things bigger than what they actually are it, you know twin flame relationship brings out a lot in a person it brings out a lot because all of us are going through that manifestation of healing going desperately wanting you know uh physical connection um being able to do that is it, it becomes a task but if it's something that you truly want in your life you're going to be willing to go through that being able to see it for what it truly is uh there's a lot of times we have insecurities on how we look or how we present ourselves or you know anything that you know you're shining light on that you're not comfortable about um it's just like with mine you know i've eliminated so many things out of my life you know stop you know drinking stop smoking cigarettes stop smoking weed you know and then it put pounds on me and stuff like that so it's just like i've been insecure about my weight and it's just like even even my daughter's like mom you're not as big as you say you are because it's just like you know i added like around probably 10 pounds on me but it's not bad but it's just like i look at myself and it's just like you know that's something that you want to change about yourself and it has you really looking at things in an ugly way but it'll make you intensify things are bigger than what they are we're making a problem bigger than we, what we are doing so it's just like you know, while your twin flame is, you know, doing and working on theirs, they have their insecurities as well. So don't think that you're in that by yourself. But if you know, if the tw twin flame relationship is supposed to be, it will be. But don't think that your twin flame is not, it's not like nothing like a regular relationship. Don't feel like, okay, if you gain a couple of pounds, don't allow yourself to say, oh, well, my twin flame is not going to love me unless I do that. They're going to love you regardless of what size you are. Um, if your hair is short or long, or, you know, if you're not exactly how they expected you to be, they are still going to love you because you are their other half. You're, you know, y'all are in oneness. So it's like you're creating and, um, just basically healing in many different ways that you know we truly needed to be and it's just like going through these different situations it you know it takes time it takes patience especially if you know you're trying to aim towards that physical union um when you're loving every aspect of yourself as much love as you're putting towards your twin flame you need to put it towards yourself as well and that that's the main you know the main thing that we need to go through so it's just like going through all these different situations Allow yourself to love yourself on every level. It's the way they love you is the way that, you know, you're going to love yourself. You're supposed to love yourself. And it's like, I've been going through that as well. So it's just like, you know, my situation is totally different. But it's just like being able to reflect on that, that has been an issue with me. And it's just like, my dad was like, girl, you are not as big as you are. <laughs> you say you are and this and this and that. So it's just like going through those situations. It has taught me a lot and it has humbled me as well. 
but knowing you know those situations they might come about but no they're that's all in the hidden psyche you know the ego wants you you know wants you to feed in those things is not really important but it's just the fact that you you know what's stopping you is just the fact that it's how you feel about yourself is all the way you can put love into your situation with the twin flame you have to be able to place it upon yourself as well so knowing you know on these stages of your your relationship it brings out things that we need to heal from it brings out things that we need to focus in on ourselves to be able to let go of being able to know that you know even though we're in the physical we're not in the physical form to connect yet knowing that it will happen if it's meant to be if they're allowing you to see that you are connecting with the twin flame there is going to be a meeting you know with me mine's different because mine is passed on but he is blessing me in so many different ways to allow me to love myself on every level you know and i was dealing with insecurities about that um being able to see things i wasn't you know really looking at in the right way so allow yourself to see the things that are unseen allow yourself to be able to connect you know if you're in that that verge of separation knowing there's a reason for everything that happens uh being able to not be in a rush for that connection um being able to work you know even though you're in that you know situation you want to deal with the bad but just the way you look at it is like hey you know um uh being able to you know basically say you know even though i'm trying to get to the physical there's a reason why we're not you know into this physical yet but that gives me enough time to go ahead and work on the things i need to work on so when we finally get to that physical connection of be everything you ever never dreamed of but you know a lot better than what it was so i hope you're able to you know resonate with the content in this video sorry it's so short but you know source and universe a they send the message i'm just the messenger so allow yourself to heal in all the ways you need to knowing you know your union is coming and even if you are in that physical connection this gives you the time to you know if you want the relationship to really work you're going to try on every aspect love yourself at all levels as ways you love your twin is that is what the yeah, same so like and subscribe drop me a line let me know you know your input on this video and know you're truly blessed a highly favored and forever loved and knowing there's always somebody you know praying out there for your better days and i hope you have a blessed safe weekend be responsible in everything you do if there's you know new moon has you reflecting on things please reflect reflect on it burn what you need to burn on the things that you're trying to let go of so you can be able to go to the next chapter so i will see you on my next video much love peace and be wild